how to balance zn plus hno3 that produce zinc nitrate plus nitrogen dioxide plus water so in the left hand side the number of zinc is one the number of hydrogen is one the number of nitrogen is one the number of oxygen is three in the right hand side the number of zinc is one the number of nitrogen here you have to consider one so uh, you have to multiply this one times two that is two the number of nitrogen here is two the number of oxygen is three times two that is six so here the number of nitrogen is one the number of oxygen is here also two so let us add then here we have hydrogen two then we have oxygen one so basically here we have three nitrogen and here we have eight nine oxygen look this nitrogen is present in two compound and this oxygen is also present in three compounds so we'll balance this atom at last because we should balance that atom first that is present in one compound so let us balance here hydrogen to one so let us multiply by two that gives us two if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom so this hydrogen has come from here so we have to place here two as a coefficient so we are getting two hydrogen then two nitrogen so let us update then two times three that is six oxygen so our hydrogen two two is balanced but our nitrogen here 2 here 3 so this is an even number and this is an odd number so we we'll try to uh, make it as a even number so look if I change here this one this one nitrogen has come from here right so if I multiply here by 2 then I, I will get 2 here right so i have to multiply here by two if you multiply here by two then look we'll get two nitrogen then we'll we'll have two times two that is four oxygen right so basically we are getting 11 oxygen so this four is a even number now so to get here 4 you can multiply here by 2 that gives you 4 if you multiply here by 2 that uh, that if you multiply here by 2 that 2 must come before this atom that is here so 2 times 2 4 if you place here 4 the number of hydrogen will be 4 so let us change the number of nitrogen is 4 the number of oxygen will be 12 4 times 3 right so now our nitrogen 4 4 is balanced but look our hydrogen is not balanced here 4 here too so it is easy just multiply here by 2 that gives you 4 if you multiply by something that something must come before the atom so this hydrogen has come from here so place here 2 so we are getting 4 hydrogen and 2 oxygen here so 4 6 plus 4 10 plus 2 12 so now look 12 oxygen 12 oxygen 4 nitrogen 4 nitrogen 4 hydrogen 4 hydrogen 1 zinc 1 zinc so everything is balanced so we can say that this is the balanced chemical equation at last you have to use this arrow sign